observant. I am known for my attention to detail. You boys look like you're gearing up for quite the journey. There's an abandoned temple in Midgard that a fellow dwarf converted to his personal storeroom. Packed it with all sorts of treasures he collected during his travels throughout the realms. Throughout the realms? Which ones did he go to? What did he collect? Fafnir was a, shall we say, aggressive collector of magical artifacts. The more he acquired, the more he desired. There was no realm too dangerous, no relic too hazardous. He once ventured deep into Niflheim for a whetstone of all things. Huh. I bet that was quite the whetstone. Does this story have a point? Yes, it does. I just happen to have an entry stone to Fafnir's storeroom. You might find something useful in there. Neat. Thanks, Sindri. You're very welcome. Oh, and uh, if you find that whetstone, well, it sure would be nice of you to bring it to me. I'd advise caution if you're heading to the storeroom. Last I was there, all manner of nastiness had taken up residence. Won't your friend be upset if we steal all the stuff? Oh, <laughs> no. No, not at all. He's dead. I think. Oh, sorry. No, no need to be sorry. These things happen when one travels from realm to realm, collecting priceless artifacts that don't belong to you. Got another story? Very well. There was a horse. The horse sought vengeance upon his enemy, a stag. But he could not kill the stag alone. The horse met a man, a hunter, and made a deal. He took the man's bit and bridle and allowed him to ride in the saddle on his back. Together, they killed the stag, and the horse tasted victory. But the hunter would not release the horse and made a slave of him. So getting revenge cost him his freedom. Hope it was worth it. It was not. We could beach the boat here. Treasures from all different realms. Do you think that Fafnir went to Alfheim too? I do not know. Aren't you curious? He sounds interesting. We go to the storeroom to collect anything useful for our journey. Not to learn more about the dwarf. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers.
this. Uh-oh. I must have gotten here first. more focused.
Boy. Another map. Great. made it inside. I hope they didn't take all the treasure. magical treasure and no what stuff keep your expectations low boy and you will never be disappointed <laughs> you off guard I wasn't expecting them exactly Resources, the main reason we are here, boy. However, many of these chests have been emptied. Probably by the Reavers. I hope they didn't take Cindy's whetstone. I told you about expectations, boy. Keep them low. I remember. Still, good feeling. Yeah! 
Focus up. I was ready for them this time. I saw. So I should keep my expectations low, but always expect an attack? It is a delicate balance. Expect the worst. Assume nothing. And always anticipate an attack. Sure is a lot to remember. Don't this up, boy! Stone. And only one room left. I know I shouldn't hope, but do you think we'll find it there? No. So, you're back to piss on my corpse, you ungrateful little... Uh, who are you two? We're looking for a whetstone. Have you seen it? Aye, there was one in this room. My son sharpened his dagger on it, right before stabbing me in the back. What? Little bastard thought it was his turn to lead my crew. I was hard on him, sure. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. I did the same thing to my dad when I was his age. He killed his own father? Where is he now? <laughs> he may be a bastard, but he's my bastard. You'll get no help from me, fool. Then his dad. Hey! Come, boy. We are leaving. Oh, we're behind you! Choke on it! Yeah. <laughs> 
pair of pasty fifus just sure can't fight. I'll give you that. betray him like that kill his own father over some treasure it seems so greedy remember what i told you boy assume nothing well sure he didn't seem like a great father but you only know half the story yes oh! enemies ahead are strong. You, uh, didn't happen to find that whetstone, perchance? We found no whetstone. This dagger belongs to the reaver who took it. They took most of the good stuff. Oh? Well, here, take this. In exchange for the dagger. The 
The dagger you brought me is quite interesting. An artless design, but the construction is sound. Where in the temple did you find this? In a river's back. Oh. Oh. He mentioned he was part of a larger clan. Maybe they took the whetstone? Quite possibly. I know I've seen this design before. Uh, wait, no, yes, yes. I don't suppose you could try keeping it. What, no? No, just a, it was a question. I'm fine, I'm fine. Travel safe, you two. What other stories have you got? There was a tale of a frog. His pond had dried up, so the frog and his son left to find a new home. They found a well. The son saw the water and made to jump in, but the father stopped him. He saw the well was deep, and once inside, they would not be able to escape if the water dried up again. Wisely, they moved on. That's it? Yes. It's really not a story. If the sun jumped in, it would be a storm. Then he would be trapped and starve while the father watched helplessly. See? That's a story. 